Sam Roberts uh, got into road after the game with Mosley. Uh, with the Bedford Blues man of the match, Phil Bolton, how was that for you, Bolts? Yeah, it was good. And uh, like I said in the marquee after the game, it's nice to get a, a win at home. And uh, we still haven't put a full 80 minutes together yet, which is disappointing, I know, for everyone watching the game. But, you know, wins are wins, so it's not to be sniffed at. You must be targeting these two games at home, back to back, as a real opportunity to gain some confidence out of games. Yeah, definitely. We need to get some momentum going. And, um, you know, it's in sport, momentum is, is key. And if we can get a couple of wins, you know, hopefully some of the boys perhaps lacking a bit of confidence will get their confidence back and we'll start seeing us playing like, you know, like everyone knows we can. The times out there, it was really good. There were some great phases and, and it sort of it stuttered and started. And I suppose that's what you're alluding to ironing those bits out and give us a full 80 minutes well I think when you look at the whole team you know there's been a lot of changes from last year to this year and I know we're halfway through the season but we still haven't actually had a consistency in selection as well and that's you know because we need to be trying new boys out I don't think people know who the uh, the full starting 15 is which I suppose is good in some ways because it's it's keeping everyone guessing but also um you know, it's given a lot of headaches to the to the coaches. Um, Mike said in the week, I think in the press about uh, boys coming back from injury, which is brilliant. And um, I think in the next couple of weeks, we'll start seeing us hitting our straps a bit more. Nelly uh, limped off. Any news on him? No, I think it was just precautionary, really. You know, with his um, with his long injury layoff and calves are a bit dodgy and been in the front row, it's you can't really hide there. So uh, yeah, it was more precautionary. I think. Now he got a bit of ice on it. I think he should be all right to train in the week and probably play next week. But we'll see uh, physios on Monday. Well done today, Bolts. Good win. Roll on next weekend, eh? Exactly. Yeah. Thanks, Sam. And we also catch up with Jake Sharp. Jake, how was that for you out there? Uh, yeah, good. A uh, couple of slip ups again from the boys, but apart from that, I mean, five points. We're happy with that, and hopefully keep that going for next week. Large passages of the game that actually look quite good, and we look quite penetrative. Uh, so that must be pleasing. And, and you've got to, I suppose, at the moment, really take out and focus on the positives. Oh, massively, again. massively. I mean, I mean, the negatives are there, but uh, whatever level you play, whoever you're playing against, there's always going to be them. But I think we just keep going each and next week. They've got nothing to lose, so they're going to come firing again. And we've got a nice run of games at home. Obviously, London Welsh in the middle, but hopefully we can get those four wins at home. And you know, hopefully take 30 odd points from that, and then we're happy, and then we we'll just keep going. That was a good Mosley side. I mean, they, they oh. turned over Bristol. Yeah, yeah, exactly. They beat Bristol, and I mean, the league just is just talking for itself at the moment. I mean, no one's winning all their games, no one's losing all their games. I think London Welsh one stayed last kick of the game against London Scottish. So there's no, I don't think there are any favourites at the moment. I think, and I think the key is for now, and what we spoke about in the week was just consistency, consistency in the squad, and consistency in how we play, and whoever comes on does what they're told, and we do that. and I think it showed today that, apart from the little slip-ups, it does work and that we are a tough side to beat. Good period of play for you yourself, personally. How's it looking? Yeah, really good. I'm uh, happy with how I played. A uh, few holes opened up, managed to get through. Um, uh, dropped one over the line, which was a bit of a shame, but you know, what, what can you do? But um, yeah, I'm happy. I'm glad how I'm playing. and It's nice to be first choice and hopefully try and take the kicking duties off Pritch, but I don't think that's ever going to happen. But, <laughs> but we'll see. But no, it's really good. It's really good. Jake, thanks for your time. Cheers, Cheers mate. Cheers, mate.